first thing we saw at the Immaculate Conception Hospital was a family waiting outside on the sidewalk for surgery. The mom was holding her child's IV bag and he was struggling to breathe. Eric Hewish is a med student with our group. It's this child right here and it has what's called a volvulus, which is where its intestines wrap around each other and it obstructs any sort of um, passage of any uh, fecal matter. And so it's very dangerous because it can distend and it can rupture and cause an infection that will kill the infant. We learned the infant is 15 months old. John Collins has not gotten any nutrition since the bowel obstruction happened. Now, surgery to straighten out his intestines will fix the problem, but he's so malnourished at this point, it's risky. Yeah, they're giving the baby oxygen. They think he has an upper respiratory infection from aspirating some of his vomit that is pretty common with some sort of obstruction. Um, he is on the oxygen. We are patiently waiting for the Haitian surgeons to come in. Uh, things move a little slower here. It's a little less organized than you'd expect to see back home. John Collins died before they even began surgery. The doctors told me that he was so weak when they started the anesthesia, he began to relax and he quit fighting. We'll have more tomorrow.